Hey everybody! I'm here today to tell you to never ever forget this with mirror checks. I'm going to be going over one specific thing that you should never ever forget to do when you are checking the mirrors within your car. Now obviously your car is going to have three mirrors, let's hope. It's going to have a rear view mirror and it's going to have a left side mirror and it's going to have a right side mirror. So a rear view mirror and two wing mirrors. That is three mirrors in total. Now most people will check the mirrors but a lot of people forget to do this one thing and it can cause them to get into an accident. It can cause them to fail their driving test. It can cause them to get honked at all the time. And that specific thing is assess. So many people will check their mirrors, but what they forget to do is they forget to actually assess what's happening in their mirrors. Now, if you don't assess, then pretty much checking your mirrors is pretty much pointless, okay? Because let's break this down for you here, because if, especially if you're taking your driving test, this is super duper important. Okay, let's break this down for you. If you check your mirrors, the whole purpose is to make sure that it's safe to turn or switch lanes or pull over or pull away from the curb or whatever the case is. You're looking basically for other cars, pedestrians, uh, you know, light posts, uh, trees, uh, curbs, anything. You're looking for anything in those mirrors. And when you check your mirrors, you have to assess whether or not those things are there. Okay. So let's say I'm on the driving test. I'm taking the driving test. Okay. And I'm, I'm checking my mirrors, right? So like the, the driving test examiner's like, wow, oh, good job, great work, okay? I'm checking your mirrors, good job. I don't know who talks like that, but anyways, good job, great work. So I'm checking my mirrors, and then I'm going to switch lanes. I check my mirrors, okay? Oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. And then the driving test examiner hears a horn because I almost hit someone because I didn't I, I didn't see them in my mirror so what happened is the driving test examiner is saying good job great work you know when I'm checking my mirrors but then all it takes is that horn and they know that I didn't actually assess what was happening in the mirrors or I didn't assess it properly so basically I looked in the mirrors but I didn't care what was happening with within the mirrors and that's a huge problem because then what's the point of checking your mirrors, right? At the end of the day, your mirrors tell you just as much as when you look in front of the car. Because looking behind the car is actually more important than looking in front of the car. Because when you look in front of the car, you can see everything, okay? It's, it's like that, naturally. But what, what you can see unnaturally is what's happening behind your car. So you gotta look in your mirrors and assess in your mirrors to see what's happening on the sides of your car and behind your car. And really, like, if you see a car in front of you, you're gonna break, it's natural. But when you switch lanes, you're doing something unnatural and basically you're changing the position of your car and you really need to make sure that no one's there. So it's even more important to check your mirrors and assess your mirrors. Now, like I said, this is super important if you're taking your driving test because the driving test examiner needs to know that you're assessing what's happening in the mirrors. And they'll know that because when you check your mirrors, you're not gonna get honked at. You're not gonna get into an accident. You're not gonna cut someone off. You're not gonna hit anyone or anything. And if you do that, then they know that you're assessing. Or you got lucky and you didn't you didn't assess, but there was just nobody there. And luck runs out. So if you do, if you switch lanes, you know, 10 times on the driving test, it's very uh, un unlikely that you're gonna get lucky all those 10 times. So learn to assess your mirrors. Don't just check your mirrors, assess your mirrors. And please never ever forget to do this with regards to mirror checks. Because if you're checking your mirrors and you're not assessing, it's pointless. And I see people do it on the road. Like, uh, you know, people that have clearly had their license for a while based on how they're driving. And how comfortable they are but they check the mirrors and then they switch lanes okay and there's someone there that they cut off and it's like I know you checked your mirrors because I saw you do your your head bob around like that okay <laughs> I saw you but what happened was you didn't actually assess what was happening because you just cut that person off it doesn't make any sense but anyways I really wanted to make this video because it's like a crucial point that I feel like it, it doesn't get spoken about often enough so never ever forget this with mirror checks if you like this video please be sure to give it a thumbs up let me know what you think down below as a comment and of course be sure to subscribe for more great car and driving videos just like this one and that's all I have for you today thanks for watching